Hi guys, as you can see, tonight's little vlog. I'm down on the coast. I'm down on the Fylde coast at Lytham. Um, just arrived. I think... You better shift your thing, George. Hi guys, as you can see tonight, we're on the Fylde coast. Um, it's about 25 minutes before sunset, so uh, I'm hoping that just in the distance there, you can see this little band of clouds um, over towards Blackpool Way. The sun's shining beautifully, but We'll just see if we get any luck tonight. Um, the tides are still on its way out. Um, as you can see in the distance there, it's kind of not it's not as not as calm as what it normally is. I think this is because the tide's still going out. Once that goes out fully, it'll stop. And it, hopefully, fingers crossed, it'll be like um, like it was the other night, like a pond. Um, got a couple of boats over this way. The one I'm going to concentrate over there is a tin one. It's um, it's bobbing about at the moment. So in a second, I will talk you through the shot that I'm going to go through. So that's the boat I'm aiming for, I've got my camera set up there and as you can see just in front of the camera there um, the water's gone a little tiny bit calmer um, I'm just going to wait for another half an hour maybe until this boat kind of stops and if I, just spin, if I just spin the camera around to show you over that way, that's where the sun's setting at the moment I'll just turn it down, you can see the sun is just on the horizon I think it's about 25 minutes before it's sunset so We'll wait to see if we can get any good colours. So for this shot I'm going for, as you can see in the bottom here, there's all white bits of foam, but when you do a long exposure, they're making like twisty curly shapes. So I'm at F16, ISO 100, and I'm going for a 30 second exposure, even though the boat, as we speak, is just turning right round. So it'll look like a ICM shot, I think. Right, this is the last shot I'm going to go for. So, at the moment, I'm at ISO 100, F11. I'm going for a 10, ex 10 second exposure, and hopefully, the boat will stay still. So, if it's any good, I'll post the image in a second. So, as you can see, I'm in the water, and that's the boat there. I'm just going to try for one more shot, but as you can see, it's kind of moving around too much to make a decent image, and uh, I'm not getting the long exposures. I'm only getting half a second, which doesn't make for a good image. There's loads of nice colours and if I just spin the camera around over towards Blackpool Way, it's not it's lovely to be fair. And over the back of that way, I think that's Southport Way. It's um beautiful colours, but just the boat's not playing games, it's kind of moving all over the place. So I'll take one more shot and if it's no good, I'm gonna call it a day. So if you look now you can see all down here all these beautiful colours, but the boat that I'm aiming for at the moment it just won't stay still. And I think what it is is if you're looking front of the boat 
it's part right in front of the current so you can see the water rushing against the boat um, so I'll just move to the side there I don't know if you can see the boat but it, it's actually not staying still so I think I'm going to call it an evening for now anyway so I'm going to take, take one last shot I'm at F, F8 and then we go for 4 seconds ISO 200 and we'll see if we get this boat nice and sharp and if the image is any good I shall post it in a moment So this is going to be the last shot of the night. I'm going to use this little tractor here and just try and capture some of this colour above it. If the picture's any good, I shall post it again in a second. Right, as you can see, I'm back at the car now. Hope you liked this little vlog. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, give it a little share, and leave your comments down below. Until next time, goodbye. <laughs>